Now I want to look at the deficits and the debt. These are two different things. Deficits, that would be my annual shortfall. And basically what that means is that my spending is greater than my tax revenue. And the summation of my deficits is my debt. So let's look at what these amounts are here for um, the United States. Um, the debt this year, or the deficit, I'm sorry, this year, um, uh, the estimate, at least for the year 2018, is that it's going to be $440 billion, so almost half a trillion dollars that we're short. Um, so we're spending about half a trillion dollars more than we are bringing in, which then basically means that the um, debt goes up as well. Um, the national debt right now is, yeah, it's about um, $19 trillion. That's a lot. Um, at this point, it exceeds the um, annual production within the United States. So as a percentage of GDP, um, it exceeds 100%, which is not a good thing. Um, If you want to look at a scary website, go to usdebtclock.org. It's kind of like a, just a pile of numbers. They're all increasing rapidly. But if you look at that, you get their most updated numbers here. Um, and as I look at U.S. Debt Clock here in December of 2017, is actually the national debt right now, as it's going up, is about $20 trillion. Um, and um, the... Uh, Deficit is about $670 billion. I'm not sure what faith to put in these numbers because I'm not sure exactly what sources they're using, but it gives us a general idea of um, how much short we are in things. Uh, the, probably the most important thing would be is that, again, if we look at our debt-to-GDP ratio, it's greater than 100% which basically means we'd have to do nothing but produce for a year and we'd be able to pay off the, um, the debt. Now, the deficit and the debt changes year to year, uh, but things have dramatically increased um, really since the 1980s. We have spent far, far more money since the 1980s um, than we ever have.